and even after today. May God bless you and me. May the good Lord replenish you for every money spent today. Amen. So shall United Kingdom Association of Professional Wedding Engagement Coordinators of Nigeria. Welcome. chapter. We will fail in Sokoto Bella and Association of Professional Wedding Engagement Coordinators of Nigeria, Apwekon, UK Chapter, our general meeting holds on every first Monday evening at 7 p.m. For more information, call the president, Ken Michel Waniku, on 07-932-406087. Or the secretary, Bume West, on 07-473-904499. Apwekon, Association of Professional Wedding Engagement Coordinators of Nigeria, UK Chapter, at an everlasting color to your memory day. Engagement coordinators, also known as Alaga. We always make occasions great. We are joy and glamour. To the home of bride and bridegroom, we make sure we can sell them. May God make them productive and the union permanent. We are not here for competition, but to make their day groovy. Their happiness is our concern, even after today. May God bless you and me. May the good Lord replenish you for every money spent today. Amen. So shall it be. Astamine promotes good health in adults and children. With Astamine, vitality and vigor is promoted, especially during hard work and sports. Also, Astamine helps fast recovery from illness. With essential amino acids and vitamins in Astamine, your body will perform optimally. You can find Astamine in all registered pharmaceutical shops across the country. Astamine, the building blocks of good health of the family. Astamine, marketed by Fitson Healthcare Limited, the company that values life. Let's have a bush in law, UK and Jaw White. Now I'm saying I'm chilling with DJ Ali. On fair no she like to go to no see well. And learn your boss in CEO. On fair no she lady at the motion ball, be trying this time. You will get burn, burn, burn. Yeah, DJ Ali, big teasy. Let's have a bush in law. Shout to everyone, east, west, south, north. DJ Ali, Big Zip. I am a Africa, 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 I am a Africa,
Hello, good day. This is Lee Corners on Hey Radio, with you. A program that gives you a shoulder to lean on. Join me on Hey Radio. with you. Let's discuss your pains, those things you feel you want to share, those experiences you want the public to learn from, the sweet memories you feel like sharing. Who knows? That could bring smiles to the face of someone somewhere. This is Blue Corners again on AYO Radio. I am Toka Stillers. Thank you for joining me, for tuning in. Ma <laughs> Yes, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, uh, wherever uh, you are listening to us from. This is AYO Radio United Kingdom. My name is DJ Ali and I'm your smooth operator today. Yes, the program you're about to listen to is Mr. Velocity, yes, Oladity Iyanu, on how to start your business. This is part two. It's very important if you want to... Uh, Start a successful business, please gather here and listen to this program. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going live with Mr. Velocity, Velocity himself. Ladies and gentlemen, it's very important that you listen to this program. It's very educative for especially people who wants to, um, people who want to start their business. Please gather here and learn how to start business. And this is part two. Uh, Mr. Velocity, welcome to AYO Radio. You are now live. Yeah, good day everyone listening to me out there. Vidyali, I greet you this afternoon. Let me hear boss. Uh, Nami 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 you are the boss. You are the boss. Well done, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, good day to everyone out there. I am glad to be with you again on the best online radio, the most charismatic radio, which is AYO Radio UK. Yes, and we're always glad to serve you in a better way because we are here for you. Now, you, now, now they make us, they run. They run because of Una. Yes, my name is Ola Tiyano, and this is Solutions with Velocity. Yeah, and, um, well, I must say today I'll be wrapping up on starting up a business. Yeah, I think for the past um, four or five weeks we've been saying on different things that would actually help you this is put into consideration when starting your business. So today we'll just be wrapping everything together and making it a whole thing. And I believe that by then, by the end of today's show, you'll be able to go out there and actually restructure and rebrand your business. Yeah. And uh, this is a wide old radio. We always love to hear from you. We love to always hear your views, know your comments, have your feedback, because we are servicing you people and we need to hear from you. We need to be sure that we are actually delivering our best to you. So for feedback, for comments, for questions, for observations, you can contact us through this number, plus 447487070261. I'll come again. I'll say it again rather. Plus 447487070261. So that is the studio number. You can send us a WhatsApp message. You can call us. You can drop us in text. That means you can just send your feedback, send your comments. Or you can also go to social media and drop us comments there. You see, um, just start with DJ Ali Journalist. DJ Ali Journalist on Instagram, on Facebook. You can search, send your inbox in your questions, inbox in your observations. 
inbox in your comment, inbox in your, your feedback. Yeah, if you have criticism, feel free to let us know so that we can actually work on it to improve. We are really willing to hear from you. Yes, this is a solution we can love this week. And uh, I am glad to be with you again on KY Radio this week. So very quickly, we have a little bit of ground to cover. And um, starting a business, I think about six weeks ago, um, I was here and I said something about if you want to start a business, you need your drawing board, which means you need somewhere where you all your plans. You know this thing that um, FBI, CIA, they do, they have this board that one day the criminal case on that board, they just pin all the facts, you know, about the criminal on it, then all the junior ranks or all the officers on that case who come into the room and the team leader or the, the detective or the agent will not tell you, okay, in 1994 was at Miami, then from there we were able to trade him down to Puerto Rico, then from Puerto Rico we saw him in the UK, and last week he surfaced in, um, in Malambu. Then they tell you, okay, and we've been able to know that it's all these, he potentially did, he used this kind of car. So they show you all the dots, that you shouldn't do right to connect those dots. So that is what I am referring to as a drawing board. If you're going to run your business, or if you're running your business, you need something like that. So that you can keep track of events. You can keep track of your goals. You can keep track of your thoughts. But when ideas come, okay, maybe you're running a business, and an idea, idea came to your mind, and it doesn't look like it's, it's making sense, like it doesn't really apply. You know what? Don't throw it away. Write it on a sticky note. Put it on your drawing board. Maybe your drawing board is in a book. You go to your drawing board in your book, write it down, and have a big idea. Okay, so, 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 this, so, 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 this. Leave it there. Don't worry. When it's time, if you're looking for an opportunity to actually meet with the president, and you've written it on your drawing board that, look, as you're running this business, you are looking for to actually meet the president. Because this is what we think will give us that massive, um, that massive, um, I don't know, that massive funding of, of cash. So once you put your drawing board, once a while, I say something like you review your drawing board every three to six months, depending on you, or you could do it twice a year, or you could do it once a year, but it depends on you. So maybe you review your drawing board that, and you're able to do you know, that three years ago, we said you could meet the president. It will really cause a very great boom in our business. So, and you heard the president is coming to your neighborhood and then they need to volunteer. Trust me, that review will make you know that okay, I need to volunteer. Even like, if it was not written on your drawing board, you could have forgotten. If you didn't review your drawing board, it will be there without you remembering. And the president will be coming and they will asking for volunteer. you like, no, me, CEO. Or me, managing director, I can't be volunteering. Meanwhile, this is what you know you need it. And you still need. So these are some of the usefulness of dream board. So I can remind you of some things that you thought of and opportunities coming because once you can feel this the opportunity I'm looking for. So that keeps down. So when the opportunity comes, you will remember. I will tell something about them. Um, we said other things. About you being able to recognize opportunities and you being able to take opportunities, then you've been able to see things from another perspective that is not being um not being a one way thinker. That is okay, sit down and do it, but okay, take time out, take a step back, observe it again, and check, okay, can it be done this way? Not necessarily because you want to change your mode of doing it, but let's see. Can if we do it this way, can we achieve more results? If you look at it like this, if there's opportunity for more results, just just review it. Don't assume the view you have is the best. If you're looking for another view, can be a means of adding a concept to it, who actually increase the efficiency and increase your income, your profit margin. And also, we said something about communication. That is, as a brand, as a company, you know your target audience, you know your market, you should be able to communicate effectively. To your market. If you are targeting um, salesmen or saleswomen that is the local traders in the market, that is probably they are not really, they are not um, completely literate, probably semi literate, these are people you are targeting with your product. So you should know that your marketing strategy has to be tailored for them, such that if you do a strategy that will 
catch their attention. So they want to see the ad bad, when they see the marketing strategy, they as market teammates will, will be able to relate with that uh, with that marketing plan immediately. So you'll be able to communicate effectively to them. And also we said something about standards that as a company you need to have a standard and whatever standard you are choosing, please you need to be able to maintain that standard. Yes, AYO radio when I came and uh, you know um, manager will tell you, okay, you must book before so, so, so time. And I'm like, ah, okay, that is not hard. It's not hard. So we started, fast, fast, fast. You have booked. Okay, we'll tell you you have been booked. Your show is this time. Confirm it. Once you confirm, then one day I booked. Okay, you're going to book. I think let's okay, let's just say you book before 10. Then fortunately, I booked by 11. And I, in my mind, I felt that yeah, uh, it, will, it, will, it will just allow, it will let me fly. Next thing, the DMs is like, bro, you don't do like that. You don't allow that. The 10 is 10. What is one is beyond 10. So if that deal shows me, then so I won't even wait till that money. I will make sure it's a day before so that, we, so that next up will not fail me. Yeah. So if you are creating a standard, you must be able to live up to that standard. So that not for one moment the standard will drop. No. You should be able to live up to that standard. So I advise if you are trying to improve on your product, if you know you will be able to be on that improvement, please stay where you are and just increase your customer service. That is another very entire goal. Just increase your customer service. Once you are improving your standards, you must have the manpower, the technical know how. The, the machinery to actually stay on that standard. Because it's a common thing in some of our products so that you see them, they are coming out for the first time and they are giving you a hundred over hundred product. Now people love this, like, wow, this is excellent. This is bad. Then after three months, four months, quality drops, even the, the packaging drops. Then people will be like, whoa, 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 what? Then before you know it, Confidence in the company is done. So please, as a business that is just coming up, or a business that is trying to reinvent itself into the market, please do well to start on a standard. It's better you start on a standard and then improve. Now for you to stand on a standard and then you are dropping. Drop is not allowed. So today, I'll just do a recap in about six points on how to start your business. Don't forget, this is AYO Radio. The best way you can listen to the solutions with velocity. What comes to what will bring problems in every in different sectors of life and we consider and we brainstorm, we gather and we decide and we bring to you practical solutions to such problems. So please don't change the dial. You can join us on Fastcast Radio or TNA or you can just Join live videos on social media, Facebook, Instagram, or you can also we have other programs that you can check on YouTube. Yes, from like of MC Beta, Alero King, Olamide Queen, and so many other people, Pastor Kadiri. So please feel free to want to check other videos and other um, radio shows on this on this charismatic radio station. So let me start. If you are going to start your business, first thing you need to do is research. You can't afford to be lazy. You need to do research. You need to stand up and go out there. Now, there's a fact in front of me which says there are more than 38 million small businesses in the United States, making up 99.7% of all these U.S. businesses, according to Small Business Administration. Now, imagine 38 million small businesses in the U.S. Now, imagine the amount in developing countries like Nigeria, Ghana. If the U.S. can have that high amount of small businesses, now, imagine, in short, I in some countries, the only business that has small businesses, there are no big businesses. So, you can let you know the, the, the strength, the importance of small businesses, and how you can stand out. Imagine you start a business in the U.S. You only have 28 million people. 
exhaustion. So we need to we need to be sure. It's not a maybe. It's a yes or a no. You need to be sure. So you need to do your research. Make your findings. So ask questions like they need for your product. Who needs this? Are there companies doing similar product? What is competition like? Who will how will my business be to this market? How will I market my business? So those are questions you have in your research. Go around, don't sit at home. I know internet has made it easy. But see, there are few things you find on the internet. Imagine you have um, something like um, um, McDonald's next to you. Go in there and just buy buy one of their products and talk to one of the people there. How are you doing? How is everything? Wow, I love the quality of your product. What's the secret? Like, we you guys do this thing? Trust me, nobody is fighting me. And you know they will respond. Walk into that look at supermarket. Ah, how do you guys want it? You guys, the way your shelves are arranged, we can do for you guys. This is our own. You get Ask us, you can see them online how to arrange shelves. When it can't be compared to you meeting the person that arranges the one in that your local supermarket. And you can able to, okay, let, that, let, me, let that give me hands on experience. For some, you can volunteer. If you know you want to go into the um, logistics transportation business, I have a system that does logistics and transportation. Go there, tell them that volunteering for three months, I have three for the next three months, and you like to volunteer. And you volunteer when you learn the system, not because you want to run them and send them out of business, but because you are there to learn. And even within your three months, you add value, you don't just go there and just bring them. You add value, you show them how to improve. And within three months, You've got to watch your head. So there are ways to do with that, not just with internet. Two, hmm, make a plan. That's where your brain board comes in. As you are doing research, your brain board should be getting crowded, should be increasing, should be increasing, should be increasing, should be increasing. No, no, your brain board can be four books. If you don't have a board in the house, you can buy notebooks, books, buy notes pads, you sit at your drawing board. Keep writing, keep writing, keep writing. Okay? Or you can employ the five systems, buy these four papers or full scarf sheets, keep writing, and you keep tagging the, the pages. Number one, this page one, this page two, this page three. So when you have a reference, refer to page four. So you know what you are looking for, or inconclusive will be discussed later. Then when you discuss it later, maybe you discuss on page this, look for it. Yes. It's very, and if you are good with system, you can do so many apps on the system now that make it easy. So you can make it of that as your drawing board. So whatever is convenient for you, make a plan. That drawing plan, look how I want to do this, all my business looks like, um, where do I get money from, how do we plan to sustain the business, how do we get support, who are we going to partner with. So you start asking those good questions. Then the next thing is, your financing, you plan it. That is, am I starting off with a loan? Or am I sponsoring the starting? Or am I getting somebody to invest? So you need to be sure, you need to know your source. Because it is not nice. If after three months, people are loving your product, people are, people are not leaving a brand to come to your brand, then you are running out of cash. Or you can't sustain the business. So please, as much as possible, you need to plan your finance. You need to plan it. Starting a small business does not have to require lots of money, but it will involve some, some necessary investment, as well as the ability to cover expenses before they are turning in profit. So as a value of uh, finance, you need to be sure that you can take care of one, two, three things. Your expenses will be taken care of, that the business itself will be running before profit starts turning in. Yes, I put together a spreadsheet if you can, if not to use it, or you make it of the manual paper and bio, keep your records straight, keep your records straight, um, find out the prices of your licenses, your permits, your equipment, your running costs, your rent, know these things, put them down, let me know what they will amount to. And now I'm not saying you should draw a for same cost and say now you, are, you want to do this thing. You are not assuming the cost of when it's hundred naira or three dollars. You are going now to find out okay how much will it cost me to run a generator for the next three hours. 
So you try to give that social writing now, because that is the reality now. You are not submitting it to someone you are at, at the point of time your finances, you are writing reality to so cost me five thousand US dollars to actually make my first production of five products. So you are writing it down, not upscaling or something. You are writing it down the way it is. So you are able to know, okay, this is actually the real cost. You are not committing a quotation. So you don't have uh, unnecessary misalignment. You are trying to know, okay, how much will it cost me here? Or if somebody is investing, how much will it cost this person? But actually, how much will it get us running? Hmm? So please include all these things, your marketing and advertising costs, your supplying costs, your travel expenses, if you're being a an employee, your employee costs and all. Then another thing is choose your business structure. That is sole society or partnership or limited liability company or a corporation. Those are things you should have found out the difference between them during your research. Those are the early stages. So you pick the structure you want, then pick your business name and go and register it. I think a lot of people do that, especially here in Nigeria. You don't run business, you don't register it. Then later you are off the market because somebody just saw your idea and says, you're not registered, use the idea, and it's selling more of us, that's much more finances to run it on a large scale. So please teach your business, register your business. This is possible to trademark your idea, trademark your thought, trademark your, your idea exactly. Then get your licenses and permits, use as much as possible. Don't run this, your business on um, against the law. Try and get your permit and your licenses. Please do so because it would not be nice if you're already running to about a year and then law enforcement is coming and they're telling you to pay a huge amount of money, which is, almost, which is even more than the profit you've made. It would be so discouraging and that would be a complete loss. Get your licenses and permit from the local offices. Then choose your accounting system. That is, if you're going to be doing fixed accounts, Current account, you get an accountant to advise you properly on the kind of accounting system that will fit your business so that you won't be running your business for your profit. Mm? You need to know how you separate your profit, how you separate your, then how you form back your profit, how you share your profit, and all those things. So you need your accounting system. If you're doing your research, you'll have done that work up and ask questions. Ask questions. Some of these consultations are free. Some of these are you have accountants all over, you have accountants in the mall, you meet accountants at that basketball court, you meet accountants at the football field. So these are things you should do. And then you set up the position that you, you choose your location properly. Then trust me, once you start your business, this is the last thing. Once you start your business, many well, once you start your business, see it is your business. Whether you are the one sponsoring it or not. It is your business. You must promote your business. You must promote your business. Nobody is going to do that for you. Even if you employ a marketer or a promoter, social media influencer, do yourself. But see to prove that anywhere you go, you must be able to, before you leave, they must know about your product. That is, I am now, I am now making sugar and selling sugar. And I was invited to my son's or my brother's school or meeting of something as a family member and I'm there and in the midst of meeting people, oh why are you doing I'm 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 Victor's brother, I'm Victor's father. Oh, what do you do? Fine, maybe I've been working in an office. Fine, so by office. And by the way, I actually just I make sugar and I send sugar do and it's more safe for now. If you don't mind, I can get you a few points. That's why you don't need to put it in their face, but you tell them, oh that's just it. But if you don't mind, no problem, you can just reach me. So, all right, so what you promote your business. Don't wait for somebody to, don't, don't wait for the product to advertise itself. So, please, this special night, upcoming small businesses, let us get out there. Let's promote our brand. Trust me, we can all be greater than KFC, can be greater than, um, than Surprise, can be greater than Walmart. All these big, big names, they started somewhere. So, don't worry, 10 years from now, the names, some names will come into limelight. So, who knows, in a day of business. So, please do well. A lot of people have this point and already doing, already up and their business is running. Even here in Lagos, Nigeria, and they have about two businesses who have used this idea and they are running already. So, I, so please, 
space, it might look very small, but if you're able to widen this point, then you'll be able to see that starting your business is just the beginning of you making influence and making enough money. Thank you so much today. This is all that is and solutions with velocity. Yeah, we are always glad to give you practical solutions to problems in diverse sectors of the economy that cut across tradition, cut across boundaries, and cut across ethnicity, but can be applied in any region of the world. And we are always glad to be with you. We are love to get feedback from you, your observation, your comments, your advice on social media. DJ, you can search for DJ Ali Journalist on both Facebook and Instagram and leave your questions, their comments on any of the posts. Trust me, we need two hours to get a reply. Comment, or you can also tweet at me or comment on any of my posts at velocity underscore D. That is velocity underscore D on Instagram and Twitter. Or on IDC on Facebook. Thank you so much again. This is the best video you are listening to. This is AYO Radio UK. Yes, the best radio station online you could ever be. And don't forget, AYO Radio is coming to Nigeria soon. And in a bit, we will prove that we will have many times July, as the Korodu of that one, here in Lagos, we have many times this. This year, we will be on ground. So, tell me about my name. This year, we will be on ground. And don't worry. We will see all together live with you at the Korodu studio. So, we will be glad for you to join us. To just say hello. To know you better. For you to know us better. And we believe that before the end of this year, we'll be live in Nigeria. Thank you so much for having me today. Yes, thank you very much, Mr. Velocity. This is Solution. That's starting your business, part two. Uh, Mr. Oladiti, I'm a big fan of your program, alone, alone. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. I, must, I must tell you. You know, um, uh, there's a Yoruba proverb that says, Omodigmo, uh, Agbagbo, Lafidailefe. You understand? Age doesn't mean that you are wiser than anybody. You understand? You have to learn yeah. from others. Yeah. Uh, I listen to your business and it's been helping me with my business as well because I, I judge things down. You know, I judge things down. Like Judge Too yeah. Funny will say, yeah. judge things down so yeah. that you can take something away. You understand? And uh, everything that you've been teaching us about starting business, trust me, uh, I know... For sure, Muli Fiora, Chef, or Baya, no man, so lady, or Baya, before Baya, Baya, we pay all the listeners yeah. all over the world. They are learning a lot from it. It's, it's so, uh, it's so educative. I'm telling you, um, I'm hearing things I've never even thought of uh, to incorporate in my business. I'm, and I'm thinking, wow, um, you know, so I wonder how our listeners and our viewers will be thinking as well that, wow, I've learned a lot from this program. Thank you so much. May God continue to crown your efforts. And um, also, um, on Saturday, uh, the 13th of July, when we do the meet and greet, um, have you thought of what you are going to be coaching people when you are live in concert? Well, I'm still working on it because we said blow mind everybody. Blow everybody's mind. Oh, no. Okay, blow mind, me, Lori. I'm still cooking things Yeah. So uh, well, I want something that where people will learn, like all this business solution and all that. People will love it. I'm telling you, people will really, really love it. Yeah? Yeah, no problem. Thank everything will be arranged. Thank you. Thank you. Oshie, bye. Thank you so much. Bye. You have a great day. Thank you. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. I'm your operator today. My name is DJ and lead journalist right here. You've just heard from uh, Solution, Mr. Velocity, yeah, telling you about business, how to run your business, things you need to do. He actually said something that, that I'm, I'm going to be taking home with me. He said many uh, business owners in Nigeria, they like to run business be their businesses illegally, meaning they don't register their business, they like to do shortcut and all that. Please always register. To be quite honest, uh, my business in Nigeria, I haven't registered it. And then when I had this year, 
trust me when i'm uh, go to nigeria in july i'm going to go and register all my businesses in nigeria trust me it's very very important it is very important and he said it touched a lot of things that you need to do like for example have a graph jot things down you know your plans you must have a plan everything don't just you know just just think about it jot it down it helps a lot ladies and gentlemen you can join solution with oladiti yano next week same place, same station, AYO Radio UK. Thank you so much, everyone. Uh, one o'clock, we have another program coming up. So, ladies and gentlemen, get ready. And uh, we are now going to be switching to tuning radio until one o'clock when we come back live on Facebook as well. So, at the moment, we are live on um, tuning radio and also our web player ladies and gentlemen and also remember that in nigeria we are going to be on fm that's uh terrestrial if you like or frequency modulation if you like that one better yeah we will, that will be happening happening this year so watch out for that uh, please as much as you can please support the station it's not easy to run a, uh, an internet radio station and now to change to uh fm it's not easy, you know me, I'm a poor man, trust me, but with your, your support, we can get there, trust me. Um, just to let you know that, I also uh, here, AYO Radio also train uh, young people in different types of skills, you understand, including TV, and radio presentation, video, you know, videography, you know, to be a cameraman, photography, uh, film editing and many 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 more yes our office is uh, in Nigeria so ladies and gentlemen if you want to join us or if you want to support us even AYO radio football team will be opening this year we're starting a football club this year um, with your support please 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 do as 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 best you can we are not asking for too much and to be quite honest, you can only contact me if you want to donate. You have to go to our PayPal, which is DJ Ali Journalist at life.co.uk. DJ Ali Journalist at life.co.uk. Um, my PayPal, that's where you can donate. And I will also uh, announce your donation. Uh, thank you so much. Don't wait until we start the FM. Don't wait until we start something big before you start donating. Uh, because at that time, we might not even need donation. You understand? It is now that we need your help. Thank you very much. Normally, I don't have actually ask more because we are NGO, uh, non-governmental organization. So we do need. And I think it's about time for me to be speaking. Speaking now. One year and two about sorrow, tarry about something like that. New more we pa to the shibi we found back. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to switch to tuning radio where you can listen to us 24-7. Yeah, I'm gonna be coming live again at one o'clock. Uh, go to tuning radio and search for AYO radio. We are the station with charisma. Even when you go to tuning, you can make music request you can send dedication say for example you can send dedication to um any anybody in your family whether it's a, a somebody is getting married or somebody just got married or it's a birthday or you want to send their birthday wishes you can do that on tuning and we will help you to announce it and it will be there on tuning permanently okay Thank you very much. Oh, Paco Tello, the lady you to Koja, or no father, if that's okay to cut your money and an hour on the year to a Koja, the Nelly AYO UK, you black work or what's on your posio, Kali, the Kali Oko, little black work or there, Abala, upon the Batima for our Lawa, when you don't share the car, people who can't force it to one lady in Nigeria, and that you want a hook of his soya, a package in last domo, which you want a better. I'm 
sucking DJ all Lakers is the best journalist Dropping the mixtape, man, I just picture this Cracking the wizard still and you're overcoming it Celebrating every day, this is our list All those who trying to weigh you down no longer exist They try to knock you out, but they hand up your team buckets Yeah, that's cause you're the best of it Shout out to DJ all the journalists, let's wish, that's what's up Bumi ba bale anipa ojo bale ta shara shara ha political kona kono fi o se lu de ni kan ewa over the uk to kale si united kingdom ni london ti e kare tu wa lo ile de nigeria lati enu abderafiu ismail olaleka mc vuka radio masha ina re the super dynamic voice of the nation MC Voka ina to the other today pelu kolo fi oshelu ni bobo osose ni ikani AYO Radio UK the station with charisma eto ti o se ma gboni e tu ma gbo ni akoto lati enu MC Voka eh e ma gbo All right, King and Queens, I hope we had fun listening to this program today. I hope you had fun with Cindy. <laughs> and um, I, um, if you enjoyed listening to today's program and would like to sponsor, partner or contribute, please call or WhatsApp. Close 4479-311-78486. I repeat, close 4479-311-78486. Or you can WhatsApp 08020810958. Alrighty, thank you for listening and I hope you had a one you have a wonderful and blessed Wednesday. Have a lovely day. DJ Ali, number one DJ in London, representing Nigeria, number one DJ in the whole world, the best DJ is DJ Ali. If you don't have him, then you got nothing. Give it up for DJ Ali! Yeah! life an informative, educative, and entertaining program where we treat different topics that affect our social lives. The program is of two segments. In the first segment, we treat topics that affect our social lives. In the second segment, we bring out questions from the topic of discussion for our audience to make their own contributions and suggestions. Join your humble presenter, MC Better, as he brings to you trending topics that affect our social lives every week. From your best companion, AYO Radio, broadcasting live in UK and Nigeria at www.ayoradiouk.com. Flashlight, you can't afford to miss it. Now, wow, this is my time don't go there again. Dry and just food everywhere. But the shark, no worry at all. Don't tongue with your good friends today. Don't tongue go clear your throat and you go make your body cooler. Don't tongue. Now, wow. Drop it, drop it, yeah, DJ Ali and the Ways of Steel, drop it, yeah, drop it, drop it, that's how we do, they call me on the king, and yeah, this is how we keep back in with DJ Ali, the journalist, and all right here with you, you shall like to know.
your That's my husband's name you just mentioned. What if I see you for the middle of the to overcome it? As your God, your spirit directs you.
professional wedding engagement coordinators of Nigeria at Wacom UK chapter. Our general meeting holds on every first Monday evening at 7 p.m. For more information, call the president, Kamisha Kwaniku, on 07 932 or the secretary, Bume West, on 07 473 Tell a nigga to sponsor this show. Yo, what's the number? Call 07932. That's right. 339. Uh huh. 724. That's right. Yeah. DJ Ali. Yo, 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 what's up, yo? It's your boy, Fresh Keys, a Fresh Breeze, a Fresh Everton. I'm chilling with my man, DJ Allen, right here on AYO Radio. I hope you're enjoying yourself, too. Please keep listening to AYO Radio because it's the best radio in town. Yo, 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 it's your boy, Fresh Keys, a Fresh Breeze, a Fresh Everton. I'm chilling right here on AYO Radio. You can call it out your radio, I don't care, provided you're listening. Keep enjoying the station. God bless. Am I Joe? 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 Yeah, I need the beauty. Back, Joe, 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 yeah, it's your boy Hot Egg chilling right here with the Ali in the house. He's entertaining, educating, and informative. Joe, yeah, I need the beating. Back, Joe, Joe, Joe. Face the music. Face the music. Face the music. Face the music. Tell a nigga to sponsor this show. Yo, what's the number? Call cool. oh, 07932. That's right. 339. Uh huh. 724. That's right. Yeah. DJ Ali. One of the best radio. You're listening to AYO Radio. You're listening to AYO Radio. Services on AYO Radio. AYO Radio reaches your potential customers around the world. Why, oh, radio! Hey. 